What up everyone and welcome back. I'm assuming Eric Cartman's gonna die, but also I don't really know. It could just be like a, a figurative title. Maybe he's figuratively gonna die. <laughs> I know. I mean, we've seen Eric Cartman get crazy. Yeah. So I don't put anything past him. Yeah, uh, the Tennerman episode, Scott Tennerman, that was like uh, seeing him in a new light. At first he was just like, oh, this is a little fat racist kid. But like, you know, <laughs> we saw the, the depths of his depravity. I know. <laughs> literally a psycho. <laughs> yeah, but he's our psycho. He's hilarious. <laughs> in the last episode we saw in the My Apologies to Jesse Jackson, he was kind of wild in that oh, one no. as well too. But yeah, other than that, the title and like, you know, what we could infer from that, don't really know what this is going to be about. Assuming it's going to be Eric Cartman centric by the title, I feel like it'd be stupid not to. And if you want to see our full length reactions to this episode or any other episode of South P we do on the channel, it's available on our Patreon. We're also ahead over there on our YouTube schedule. So if you want to watch the next edited reaction, it's also there. And the ability to vote in polls to determine what episodes we're going to watch next. We're wearing different shirts. Oh my gosh, this feels God, wrong this to see them in different so outfits. Yummy. Dan, you said your mom was being Kentucky Fried Chicken home for dinner. Now, is she or isn't she? Oh. Hi, boys. Mom, she's here. She's got are just right waiting now. at the table. I want to press. Don't you crazy, right? Don't you crazy? Uh, 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 not so fast. You boys can help bring in the other groceries in the car, then have your chicken. Come on, guys. If we all help out, we can do it super fast. All right, mm. let's go. Carmen. He's going to eat all the fucking chicken. Oh, my chicken. gosh. Carmen. He's just what? eating the fucking crust. Oh my gosh! Okay, this is everything, Mom. He just, just ate the skin off of it all! Cartman, you ate the skin off of every piece of chicken! Well, I saved you all the chicken part. The skin's the best part. Well, I gotta go home, guys. I'm gonna sit what? on the party and read comic books. <laughs> that was awful what you just did! <laughs> Kenny! Oh! Kenny! You poor thing! That asshole. You he can't cried. believe it. He does this shit all the time. Well, this time he's gone too far. <laughs> The oh, chicken is too far this time. Not feeding Scott Tennerman his fucking parents. I'm kidnapping butters. Then let's just ignore him. From now on, let's not talk to him. Let's not even acknowledge him. Fuck <laughs> him. That sounds great. <laughs> Hit him where it hurts. What's going on? <laughs> Ooh, he's getting the silent treatment. Oh, wow. A Jew asking for money. There's a new one. You, you guys know why Jews have glassy Ooh, eyes? This is like the ultimate thing you can do to a, to a bully is like show that it doesn't even bother you. K Kenny, you see that chick on the news that had her left titty cut off? <laughs> Kenny? Kenny? Ooh! Stan? Stan, it's me, Eric! You have no power anymore, Eric! <laughs> like they couldn't see or hear me. Uh, does he think he's a ghost? It's almost as if I were dead. So that's the death of Eric Harvey? Oh, you've been so helpful. I just don't know how to thank you. I could think of a few ways. <laughs> oh, shit! What? <laughs> she seemed like open to it! What happened, did they say? Apparently there was so much chicken skin in the system, it just ruptured the insides. Oh, he thinks that's like this your body? Coffin? Can't be happening. What the hell is a cardboard box? Mom, mom's crying. <gasps> oh, God, it is Oh, true. my gosh. The mom. <laughs> Carmen isn't our friend anymore. We're ignoring him. Ignoring him? How come? Because he's a fat, racist, self-centered, intolerant, manipulating sociopath. <laughs> I hate Cartman too. Can I ignore him with you? Timmy! Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, the whole damn oh school? Oh my gosh! Dang, this is like the ultimate thing to do to Cartman. Anybody hear me? You guys? Token! Token! You're gonna give him an existential crisis. Hello, hello, hello. Jimmy! Jimmy, it's me, Eric! J Jimmy! Did he blow his oh. ear? <laughs> they don't even know yet that one of their best friends is dead. <laughs> dead and still wandering the earth, a lost soul. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Nobody's paying attention at all to him. No. Why are you like committing to being a ghost? I, I don't know, just ignore him. <laughs> I love what he says! Am I doomed to wander the earth alone for all the gonna talk to him? Hey Eric! He wasn't there at school, and he's just too nice. Sure, you think he could see ghosts? Oh my god, and you can hear me? He sees dead people. Well, geez, Eric, why wouldn't I be able to hear you? Because, Butters, I'm dead. He <laughs> 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 just believed him! Butters and his awful freaking parents. Butters, oh. what on earth are you doing? Well, I'm, like the, I'm like the kid in that movie. Uh, I'm seeing dead people. Six cents! The movie that's been spoiled for me so many times that I've never seen. There's plenty of real things to be scared of. 
like Super AIDS. <laughs> what? Super right. AIDS? A new form of AIDS which is resistant to drugs. Just one teaspoon of Super AIDS in your butt and you're dead in three years. The what? <laughs> His hair's all messy. Nothing to be scared of. Just some lightning and thunder. Oh. Aww. <laughs> oh my gosh. How did he get here? All right, Butters, you leave me no choice. <laughs> He's haunting him. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what is going on? What's up? Nothing. I just had a nightmare. Well, you better stop no. having nightmares or else you're going to be grounded. You what? You fucking dick. I hate his parents. What was that last little look? My spirit is trapped here on Earth. I can't find the passage to heaven. Well, <laughs> how do you know you're supposed to go to heaven? Oh, <laughs> How do you know you're not supposed to go to, you know, heck? <laughs> heck! Oh my gosh, Butters! I love Butters! He's like the cutest little thing! <laughs> supposed to go to heck! <laughs> Tell her that I wish... I wish I would have been a better son sometime. He wishes he would have been a better son sometime. It's just that... It's just that I got so caught up with the rat race of life trying to succeed that I sometimes <laughs> took my family for granted. What? <laughs> the rat race of life? You're fucking in fourth grade! Oh, sweet. Oh, I love you too, Poopykins. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> They're gonna ignore him? So it's just gonna keep saying. Well, Eric wants you to know that he's, he's sorry for all the times he made fun of you. Remember the good times. <laughs> the good times. <laughs> oh there were no good times. And if he really feels bad, he can just tell me himself. All right, come on, buddy. <laughs> he's got a list. <gasps> oh my gosh. Preacher says that before your soul can be at peace, sometimes you have to atone for something bad you did. Did you ever do anything really bad? Mm. <laughs> Not really. Where's Scott Tennerman? I took a crap in the principal's purse. Then there was the time I convinced a woman to have an abortion so I could build my own Shakey's pizza. What? I pretended to Is be retarded and joined the Special missed? Olympics. I tried to have all the Jews exterminated last spring. What? <laughs> Whose parents I had killed and then made into chili, which I fed <laughs> to the kids. Scott Boy, oh boy, Eric, you've got a lot to atone for. Really? <laughs> really. Don't forget about stealing Jimmy's joke. I know how. How? Fruit? What is this? A fruit basket? basket? That'll make it all better. Make I want to see Scott Tennerman. Oh my gosh, oh my God. How is she still a preschool teacher? Oh my God. <laughs> Like an edible arrangement will fix this. He's laying down the tracks too. I guess maybe your soul is stuck here for a different reason. I want my eternal bliss. You think oh my gosh. God. My goodness. You're ruining Butter's room. You're gonna have to get him a fruit basket too. Goodness. <laughs> Butter's room. Oh, oh my God. What have you done? It wasn't me. It was the ghost. Oh gosh. If we should ground him or call a doctor. No, I think you better call a doctor. I'll ground him. <laughs> Your son is suffering from severe dementia. Oh my- he's Dementia?! His dead friend talks to him. I think it's best that we take him to the mental center and do some tests. Oh, Good- Butters always gets like the short end of the stick. Alright, Butters, just try to relax. Oh my goodness, what technology is this? What the heck? What is going on? What the- Oh my gosh, what? Still the now, flying fuck. <laughs> what? What the fuck is going on? Don't worry, Mr. Stotch. Whatever traumatized your son in his past, we'll find it. Um, what? <gasps> well, Why after 14 did that hours happen? of testing, I can say Butters is 14? definitely suffering from aggravated repressed memory syndrome. He's gonna need to repress these memories. The ghost was in my head the whole time. Now do you believe my us, goodness. Butters? Yes, yes, sir. Butters. Oh my god. Ah! Don't worry, Butters. I'm gonna get you out of here. Please leave me alone, Eric. My bottom is really sore. Aww. Well, there's this ghost, see? Only it probably isn't a ghost. It's just a delusion brought on by my trauma. I'm supposed to he help him find out why his spirit is wandering the earth, even though I know that I'm most likely just completely insane. Aww. Oh. Soul stays earthbound is because God is intending to use that soul for a divine purpose to help prevent oh an gosh. impending what tragic What is Cartman event. gonna do with this? But now you shouldn't think you're crazy, young man. I see ghosts all the time. When's the last time you saw yours? Well, he's sitting next to me right now. Oh, is she gonna Ooh. think? 
Huh? Oh my gosh. Three convicted murderers have escaped from jail and are holding- Oh, is this like what they're gonna think that he's meant for? Like his purpose? I'm going in alone first. Give me 30 seconds in there, and then you go- Watch him literally, behind. like, stop this. Well, be careful. Go Aww. Down. Ghost fast. I'm already dead. <laughs> dead inside, <laughs> baby. Walked in. Nobody says anything. What the oh. hell is that kid doing? What the <laughs> hell is going on? I have no idea. Yes, it's working. <laughs> the book? This is really weird. <laughs> the hostages are gone. <laughs> what? Now they're gonna say he's a hero and he's yeah. gonna get all in his head. ...of confusion managed to go in and save the Red Cross. Nobody seems to know who the boys are or where they went off to, but they are heroes. Well, we did it, buddy. We saved the day. <laughs> Nothing's gonna happen again. My spirit is at rest now. I can finally go to everlasting peace, eternal rest, and $10,000 cash. Butters. Where's this $10,000 coming from? Well, I'm gonna miss you. I'll miss you too, ghost pal. I love his, like, southern draw, too. Mm -hmm. Hey, Cartman, that was really cool what you did. <laughs> yeah, Eric, we're gonna stop ignoring you now. <laughs> we didn't think that by pretending you didn't exist you would really change, but you really have. Oh my gosh. Well, anyway, we just wanted to let you know. Talk to you tomorrow. Yeah, so see ya, Eric. Butters is the one who suffered. Whatever fucking, like, procedure they put his ass through. Literally his ass. You son of a bitch, Butters. What? You told me I was a ghost. You son of a bitch. You don't blame Butters. I'm going to get you back for this. I'm going <gasps> to get you back. How dare you talk to Butters like that? Oh, oh what the fuck? I mean, that was a pretty funny episode. Uh, it's so sad how Butters got so screwed over there. I know. Poor little Butters. Things always happen to him. And a yeah. lot of times it's because of freaking Eric Cartman. Yeah. But he always has, like, such a sunny disposition about everything. Uh, I think uh, with this episode, they referenced a lot of things that we obviously haven't seen yet. But luckily enough... Because we don't really know the context, I have no idea what the hell they're referencing. I know something about the Special Olympics, but I think I've seen people talk about a Special Olympics episode, if I'm not mistaken, in the comments. Uh, there's something else, a couple other things, actually, that was referenced. But I think we'll get there eventually. But I don't really think it's spoiling anything, because I also don't really remember what he was actually saying. I really love the episodes where Butters is in it. Yeah. He's a, a bright spot. Yeah. I, I think, I've said it before, I think, definitively, it's... Oh, man, it might be Butters as my favorite episode. I mean, as my favorite character. Cartman, though, just because of, like, the crazy shit he does, I love him, too. But, like, I love him like you would love a villain, you know? <laughs> <laughs> like, I just... Seeing the outlandish things every episode from him and what he's gonna say, how he's gonna be racist next, it's like, what's... It's like Russian roulette of, like, like what he's what gonna he do gonna next. Say? Yeah. But then Jimmy... I think he's firmly number three. Just because we haven't seen a whole lot of Jimmy yet, I know that there's another episode out there that y'all have recommended. I think it was Cripple Fight, if I'm not mistaken, where I think we're going to see Jimmy again take another prominent role. Uh, we loved him in Crazy Cripples, uh, him and Timmy, <laughs> which actually just bought a Timmy shirt recently. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we'll wear it in the next sit down, possibly. Actually, let's watch a Timmy episode. And let's watch a Butters, Butters episode. Because I have a butter shirt. Casey found a Butters yeah. shirt too. So look at our playlist, see which ones we've done, and drop your recommendations for the next Butters and Timmy episode down below, and maybe we'll react to it. <laughs>